a and b are integers and a squared minus b squared equal to a b find the value of a and b okay this problem has a mm, many ways you can use gcd use other things but i want to tell you a basic solution that is useful for all students when you see this one way is to take all things to one side so if i write the main equation it will be a squared minus b squared equal to a b and in next level step i say okay a squared minus b squared i take a b to left hand side it will be negative a b equal to zero now i write a squared here negative a b minus b squared i only change the places of them now for solving this i want to use an identity the identity is this if you have x minus y squared equal to x squared minus 2xy plus y squared so i have this part i want to use the identity I know that if I place a minus b half squared, why I've understood b half because you will see a squared I can create minus two times a times b half, so it will it creates negative a b that we want here, so it will be this plus and y squared is b over two squared, so it will be a squared minus a b plus b squared over 4. So we can say if we take this to left hand side, a minus b half squared minus b squared over 4 equal to a squared minus a b. I call this star and I want to use a star here. I say okay, a squared minus a b by star is a minus b half squared minus b squared over 4 and here the rest is negative b squared equal to 0. Now I say okay negative b squared over 4 this part if we simplify is what? It will be a minus b squared b half squared minus if we factor consider common denominator 4 it will be b squared minus, uh, because if you factor from minus, it will be plus 4b squared equal to 0. And then in next step, we can say that a minus b half squared, b half squared minus 4b squared plus b squared 5b squared over 4 equal to zero and if we take this to right hand side a minus b half squared equal to 5b squared over 4 now we should work with this equation let me erase all other things okay now we say that if we multiply both sides by 4 because 4 when you take 4 inside square for example look 4x squared equal to 2x squared if you take it inside. So when 4 goes inside the square, the part that we should square, it will be 2a minus b squared equal to b root 5. Ah, let's consider this. We can say 5b2 because we multiplied by 4. Now, in second step, in next step, we can say if we consider a square root, we can conclude that. So, let me show you if a is squared equal, because here we have a, let's write if x is squared equal to y squared, we can say x equal to plus minus y. Okay, we can go. If we use this 2a minus b equal to plus minus b root 5 and now here a is integer the problem says bn is also integer so it is integer we know b is integer 
But what about b root 5? b root 5 should be integer. So, because left hand side is integer, right hand side should be integer. So, the only b that we can conclude that is integer is what b when b equal to 0. Because for other b, it is not integer. For example, 2 plus minus 2 root 5, it is not integer. It is also not rational. It's irrational number. So the only b that b is integer, that b root 5 is integer, is when b equal to 0. Now, if we replace this b, what happens? We can say that a squared minus b squared main equation equal to ab. If we combine these two things, a squared minus 0 squared equal to a times 0. So a squared equal to 0. So a equal to 0. So our only answer is when a equal to 0 and when b equal to 0. Both of them have to be 0. Okay, we've solved this problem, but let me write a homework for you. Look, it has also another solutions with number theory completely. If you want to learn them or if you want to learn important ideas that are useful in 40, 50 important ideas, you should memorize in number theory, combinatorics, algebra, and combinatorics. Feel free to send message to my WhatsApp number in the description and comments. So in homework, and please don't forget to subscribe and turn on notification and like the video. If you have other solutions, comment below this video. The homework is a cube minus b cube equal to a b solve this and comment your answers below this video. Thank you for watching and have a good day. Bye.